Hi everybody. I have a enormous headband haul to share with you. I have been eagerly watching for the mailman today, waiting for this to come. Isn't this mailer nice? So, first up, I'm going to show you some headbands that I specifically ordered, and I know what those are. And then the part I am super, super, super thrilled about is a grab bag of mystery headbands that I have not looked at yet. I have no idea what's in there. I'm so excited. So, If you've never ordered from the Happy Headband Co., I'll say that again, Happy Headband Co., you absolutely should. The owner's name is, oh, we're going to have a cat with a mailer. <laughs> Two cats, possibly. So the owner's name is Casey, and she puts her products on this nice little card, the Happy Headband Co. You really, really need to check it out. Excellent gifts for people that they wouldn't think of. Um, there is a program that she does where a portion of her proceeds put books in the hands of kids in classrooms, which is just really nice. She has a headband of the month subscription. Every few months she does the grab bag, so I, I really suggest uh, you check that out. Really, really, really nice. Very good quality. I have so many of these. I ordered so many, I forgot I got some of them. That's, that's bad. <laughs> so, first up, a couple of um, fall back-to-school themed items. This one has been sold out, I think, a few times before. This is a red apple scrunchy bow. I have one other of these, and I keep telling myself to figure out how to wear them. I haven't, haven't conquered that challenge yet, but we'll keep working on it. I just think that print's so nice. I want to say this part can come off. Yeah, this part can come off, I believe. Very nice. Um, I had my eye on this one for a while, too. This is a blue background with some juicy red apples. You'll see, let's see, do I have any? There are three different styles here. This is just the normal knotted design where she kind of takes the two sides and twists them and sews them that way. So that's just the normal design. I've really fallen in love with the um, tied version. I just think it looks nice when you wear this part in the front and that part peeks out in the back. I'm sure you could do it this way too. Kind of a Rosie the Riveter bandana look almost. So pick that one up. There are lots of times that she offers the same print in more than one style so you can pick up what you like best. I actually have this one in a blue background in the knotted or regular style. But I really liked the purple. I thought it made the little glue bottle look really nice. 
colors really like that one. Super fun. And this this um, can be untied, and so it can be adjusted a little looser or tighter, depending on the size of your noggin or how thick your hair is. There are days where I feel like headbands stay in place really well for me, and then other days where my hair, maybe it's like a second or third day hair, and it just kind of zoop, just slips, slips right off there, so. This one is um, supposed to remind you of the black and white composition book covers, which they still make. Does anybody out there remember the show Ghost Rider? Oh my gosh. Um, I just absolutely loved that show. It was a kid's mystery show. I don't remember the exact details of how they met the ghost that would give them clues, but they would write down the clues or the evidence or whatever in a composition notebook with a flare pen. And I just thought that was the coolest thing in the whole world. I want to say they kept the flare pens on a necklace and then would just pull it down and the cap would stay on the necklace. That could just be something I remember <laughs> and I made up, but <laughs> I absolutely love that show, Ghost Rider. And then, so this was a back to school um, sale she just had, but a couple other things I threw in my cart. I really wanted some um, darker backgrounds, so I picked up this black background. It's almost like a cross between black and really dark charcoal gray. With some nice um, peaches and kind of a burnt orange. I'm really loving burnt orange right now. I really want to redo my uh, nail polish on my toes to a burnt orange, but I feel like it's still the beginning of August. Maybe a little too fall for now soon 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 and then this one was on sale actually which blows my mind i always am shocked at what goes on sale because usually they're my favorite things but just not things people were picking up a nice deep navy background with some dusty green flowers and or dusty green leaves and pink flowers brain broke there for a second. I do like um, that the fabric that she buys often has such intricate designs that you could flip it either way. I guess not all of them do that, but sometimes they do. I think her florals do that, so a little less busy, super bright and pink. This one I actually saw on Instagram, so um, I would definitely check out the Instagram page, Happy Headband Co. She'll do things like headband of the day, or top sellers, or just little tips on how to style them. And I saw this um, kind of stretchy ribbed beige material. This is a top knot style. I have not purchased one of these before slightly different fabric too which I haven't tried but just with these little white or maybe cream tiny flowers and I just think I think it's a nice neutral and it goes with everything so really really happy with that okay I need to take a breath the crab bag did not um, either pay attention or whatever the last time she had a grab bag sale. I had probably honestly just put in an order and, <laughs> and probably didn't need any more at the time. So I got on a few days ago when she had a grab bag sale and boy did they go quick. I think she said on Instagram they sold out in 10 minutes. And this was all I was going to buy. Well, as you saw, that didn't happen whatsoever. 
kids come and try to get involved. Um, they are $25, and you're guaranteed um, six items, I believe she says, five headbands, and the sixth item might be a headband or a scrunchie or a scrunchie bow or who knows what, but I am so, so, so excited. Yes, 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 yes. She was putting up quick uh, previews on Instagram, panning over the pile of all the different headbands, and I, I was screenshotting the video and then looking at and looking in my phone gallery to try to figure out which ones she had available. So stupid. Sorry if you don't like the adhesive sound. doing anything wrong. That's stuck to the table. <laughs> okay, focus. Focus, focus, focus. Oh, she like, oh, I thought she wrapped them all on top of each other. Okay. <gasps> Look at that. So I was saying I really wanted some darker backgrounds. Sorry, I think my neighbor started his motorcycle. He, he will turn the thing on and let it run for the longest time sometimes. And I am not a motorcycle owner myself, so I don't know if there is a important function to that. I don't know if there's a purpose for that. I don't know. It just seems, <laughs> it just seems silly to me. A, a layman in motorcycle accoutrement. So... I have this black background with these really nice dusty blue and cerulean flowers. Oh, that's perfect. That is perfect. Ooh, and then a magenta background with some sort of tropical vibes. We've got red and lavender and turquoise and electric blue, gold, oh that's nice, that's very nice, get some good you, oh my gosh, <sighs> I can't even keep talking about this one, I can't even keep talking about this one, because I just saw what's underneath it, and what's underneath it is fabulous, this is the most exciting thing to happen, <laughs> which I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing to admit to you, but look at that. I was going to say I can still get some really good use out of this in the summertime. Look at this. Is it watercolor? Is it floral? Is it animal print? I don't know. I don't know. But it's, it's, it's just everything I need. It's just everything I need. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I tell you what, if this would were posted all by itself, I think it'd just fly off the sh shelf. Oh my gosh, there's there's a cat chewing on a plastic bag. Are you chewing on that plastic bag? Are you chewing on that plastic bag? We've got white and navy and peach and cream and blush pink. Oh my gosh. I just love, I love how it overlaps. I love how you can't really tell what it is. See, to me, that reads cheetah, but then that reads floral. Oh, I'm gonna wear this every day. Oh my gosh. I did see this one when I, when I froze the, 
the screen on my phone and took the screenshot. I was, I was very much hoping for this one. I don't even know that I have anything that matches this, honestly, but it's just so beautiful. It, it gives me like mosaic vibes, but it's a floral. This is one of those that I think would just look best with a white t-shirt and a jean jacket and just a simple, pretty floral headband. I just love that. Absolutely love that. That's the thing. That's how I convince... Oh, cat. We're falling apart over here. That's how I convince myself to buy all these headbands is because I think, well, what will that go with? What will that match? Like this one. I don't know that I have anything that matches this, but denim and white or gray underneath, that matches everything. Well, you can't wear that every single day, <laughs> but I'll try. That blingin', blingin' motorcycle. Is he finally going? Looks like some little wildflowers on a blue background, which is really nice. And then the last one is one of the tie dye. So she carries a lot of different tie dye. This one is super fun because it has completely different colors where it meets in the middle. So we've got pink on one side and blue on the other. So you could wear it in the front like this and really, you know, show that contrast. Or you could put this part in the front to show the white and cream and yellow in the front. So that's really nice. Really, really nice. Well, I am just thrilled, thrilled, thrilled. I will most certainly be getting one of the grab bags again. Usually the um, headbands are $10. Just the, the simple kind. The Tide, I believe, are 13 And I don't know about the top knot. So for $25, normally I would just get two headbands. But I got six. I got six. I'm just so excited.